In One Piece chapter 1065, it is revealed that the technology he created and used on Egghead Island was inspired by technology that existed during the ancient kingdom in the era of the Void Century. Vegapunk knows a lot about the history of the Void Century. This makes us speculate that there is a possibility that Vegapunk was actually a figure from the Void Century and jumped across time to the future. But before we start this video, please smash that like button. And if you haven't subscribed to this channel, please subscribe and click notification bell or you will miss future anime videos. One of the most mysterious characters in the One Piece series finally appears in the Egghead Island arcs. Vegapunk is claimed to be the most genius scientist in the world of One Piece. Compared to other scientists like Caesar Clown, Queen, or Vinsmoke Judge, Dr. Vegapunk's intelligence is far above them. Dr. Vegapunk, who is currently working for the One Piece world government, it is mentioned that his intelligence exceeds the intelligence of humans who have studied 100 years. Called the most genius scientist in the world of One Piece, Dr. Vegapunk has made a number of important discoveries that are very beneficial for the Navy or the world government. Interestingly, it was revealed in One Piece 1065 that several important researches and discoveries were made by Dr. Vegapunk especially on Egghead Island. It turns out that all the technology on the island imitates the technology of the ancient kingdom that once existed in the Void Century. The big question among One Piece fans after being shown this fact is how can Dr. Vegapunk make such advanced technology? And he adapted it all well from the technology of the ancient kingdom. There are two interesting theories that answer this question. The first theory is that there is a possibility that Dr. Vegapunk is a figure from the ancient kingdom who came from the past and is now present in the future. This theory makes sense considering something similar was done by Kazuki Toki. As you know, Kazuki Toki once used her devil fruit power to send nine red scabbards and Momonosuke into the future. In fact, Kazuki Toki told that she came from the Void Century and traveled through time to the future with her devil fruit power, then met Kazuki Oda. Something similar could have been done by Vegapunk, or maybe Kazuki Toki had a connection with Vegapunk and sent Vegapunk into the future. The second is that there is a possibility that Vegapunk is from the future. Vegapunk's knowledge of futuristic technology makes me suspect that Vegapunk really is from the future. We can't see this from Egghead Island itself. It is said that Egghead is a winter island in the new world belonging to the world government, which houses the laboratory of Dr. Vegapunk. It also has the label of Future Island, and is said to be 500 years in the future. It is located southeast of Wano Country. If that's the case, then what is the purpose of Vegapunk coming to the present? It was possible that his goal was the same as Kazuki Toki's. Make sure the messages written on the Poneglyphs get to the right people, so that the truth can be revealed. We can't see this from his close relationship with Dragon, and his interest in Luffy, and the Straw Hats crew. 